All right, everybody. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use an external power supply for your Canon DSLR. This is a EOS Digital T2i, an older camera, but this is valid for T3i, T4i, and T5i as well. And uh, how you can not use batteries in a studio setting. We'll get started right after this. Yeah, so I have here a, a T2i that I've had <laughs> quite a long time. It's a nice little camera, 18 megapixels. It takes pretty good cameras. It's got a 51.4 on the end of it. But, um, you know, it's getting long in a tooth. But for going on photo shoots, I've got this battery grip. And inside the battery grip, I've got two batteries. So what I'm going to show you today, basically, is um, something... To get rid of these inside a studio so you can keep these charged up somewhere uh, important and I have this I bought this at Amazon for it was under $20 and I'll have the link in the description on in an Amazon link if you wish to buy one but uh, found it one of the best buys. I also have one of these for a Nikon but I'll demonstrate in a, a second video but I want to demonstrate this for a Canon and really all it is, I mean, you just put your power supply in there like that. Okay, so we have that hooked up to power. And let me straighten out the cord. Okay, and we'll just plug that into power source. All right, then we have a little contraption here, which is just a, a DC or... Uh, power adapter really. You know, if you'll notice it's the same size and dimensions as the battery that's used in these cameras. And what we need to do really first on the side here is where you would stick the power adapter thing. Um, so the, the power cord. So we put the power in there like that. And then, <laughs> on this one at least, I'm gonna show you what I do with my, my battery grip, because so you only need one. The both the batteries are removed. We're just gonna, all you really have to do is push it down into place. It snaps into place. We need a little place. It has a, um, on the battery grip itself, there's a, there's a place for the cord, for actually this kind of, contraption to work. As, I don't know if you can see this, but there's a little door, a little flap hinge here at the, on the battery grip. You just push that in. Or let's get it in place right the right spot. We push it in and we lock it. It's locked in place and we should have power. And so if I turn this on, let's take the ones off. And we have power, and we have, if you can see that, we have power, and it's on night portrait. I don't know how it got there, but let's go to video. Okay, so we're on a video, and we see the video screen. One thing I haven't done on this camera is I haven't installed any, um, like, magic lantern or anything. So just a default Canon screen, and I'm running off juice here here's my two batteries I'm running off AC adapter down here that there's the battery indicator down here and it shows battery with charge so it, it doesn't give you a percentage charge but it shows there's a charge on it but I mean we're running off the, uh, the external power supply anyhow I just wanted to show you that that's less than twenty dollars and uh, you will never run out of a battery inside of a studio set up again and it's pretty long I mean the you can put that on a tripod and um, you know, I haven't had any real problems or issues with it so there you have it that is the external power supply for a Canon EOS digital camera this is a Canon T2i but it will 
It's advertised to work the same on a T3i, a T4i, and a, a T5i. As long as you're using this one, I guess this is the LPE8 uh, Canon battery module. And if you're using that battery and this thing's under 20 bucks on the Amazon, get it in the description below and uh, works pretty well. I'm satisfied with it. I gave it a thumbs up. Until next time, see ya. Hasta luego.